Another day, another story. Hello, healthy Habitat family. Have you ever heard the saying, an apple a day keeps the doctor away? Well, while many fruits are incredibly nutritious and beneficial for us, some may not be ideal. Especially if you're dealing with high blood pressure. Stick around because today, we're revealing the five worst fruits for high blood pressure. And here's a surprise. Fruit number three on our list will definitely make you raise an eyebrow. But before we dive in, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click the bell for more health insights. Let's get started. Fruit number one, licorice root. When you think of licorice, fruit might not be the first thing that comes to mind. Yet, licorice flavoring, derived from licorice root, often makes its way into many fruit-flavored sweets. Here's what's concerning. Licorice contains glycyrrhizin, a compound that can elevate blood pressure levels. When consumed in large quantities and over prolonged periods, glycyrrhizin can not only lead to spikes in blood pressure but also disrupt normal heart rhythms and even cause muscle weakness. It's crucial to monitor your intake of products containing licorice, especially if you already have blood pressure concerns. So, while licorice might satisfy your sweet tooth, it's worth thinking about its potential effects on your heart health. Fruit number two, canned tomatoes. Fresh tomatoes? An absolute delight, filled with essential vitamins and antioxidants. But the canned versions come with a caveat. Canned tomatoes, and their derivatives like sauces and soups, often pack a hefty dose of sodium. Sodium, as many of us know, can contribute significantly to high blood pressure. While the convenience of canned goods is undeniable, it's crucial to be aware of their sodium content. Regular intake can stealthily push your daily sodium levels beyond recommended limits. If you must opt for canned options, seek out low sodium varieties and always read the labels meticulously. Fruit number three, dried fruits. Dried fruits are a favorite for many. They're delicious, easy to carry, and seem like a healthy snack option. However, the drying process concentrates not just the flavors but also the sugars present in the fruit. Consuming these sugars in large amounts can lead to weight gain, indirectly increasing the risk of high blood pressure. Additionally, to enhance shelf life and taste, some manufacturers add extra sugar and even salt. While dried fruits can be a part of your diet, it's essential to practice moderation. Where possible, choose unsweetened and unsalted varieties to get the benefits without the hidden risks. Wait up! Before we reveal fruit number 4. Did you know that certain supplements can assist in maintaining a healthy blood pressure? I've provided links to bestseller recommended supplements like vitamins, fish oil, and multivitamins in the description box below. Check it out! Fruit number 4. Pickles. Crisp, tangy, and a burst of flavor that's what pickles add to our meals. However, beneath that zesty taste often lies a significant amount of salt. The pickling process, which preserves the cucumbers, leans heavily on salt. Making most pickles a sodium-loaded food. Regularly consuming foods high in sodium, like pickles, can lead to elevated blood pressure levels. If pickles are your staple side, it might be worthwhile to explore homemade versions where you can control the salt or scout for commercially available low-sodium options. Fruit number 5. Coconut Water. Revered as nature's hydration solution, coconut water is a tropical delight. But here's where things get tricky. Not all coconut water is created equal. Some commercial versions of coconut water stray away from the natural goodness. Adding sugars and, at times, sodium to enhance taste and shelf life. Consistently drinking these altered varieties can negatively impact blood pressure over time. If coconut water is your go-to drink, ensure you're sipping on 100% natural and unsweetened versions. A good practice is to always check product labels. Ensuring you're consuming what Mother Nature intended and not a chemically altered version. And there you have it. The top 5 fruits you might want to reconsider if you're dealing with high blood pressure. And, hey, before we wrap up, don't forget to check out the recommended supplements in the description below. They're bestsellers for a reason. Thanks for tuning in today, and as always, take care and keep thriving in your healthy habitat. Stay vibrant and informed, dear viewers. See you in the next one.